Hey YouTube, it's your girl B, and I am back with a mini Avon haul. Um, recently I purchased a lot of products from Avon, like a lot. And it's going to be a lot of reviews and a lot of videos up on my website, um, which has some new content starting tomorrow, so I'm really excited about that, the new design, everything else. Um, but I did want to follow up on my recent Avon Ideal Shade uh, video and show you guys that I did get more. As you know, I got the coffee... Um, no, the caramel cream and powder foundation, and then I got the toffee pressed powder. So here's my Avon bag. Yay. And like I always tell people, I try not to overwhelm myself by trying to purchase every single shade at one time. What I did was I got three more cream and powder foundation, and I got three more pressed powders. So that makes four shades of um, the cream foundation and four shades of the pressed powder. And that's enough to go in my kit to get me started. I can add on other shades as I go along. Now mind you, these will all be depotted. I will have swatches and close-up photos on my blog come tomorrow. So this one is the Dark Cocoa. And this is the darkest shade that they have. So here is this one. And in my previous video, I did show how easy it is to depot these. And they all come this handy sponge. I am going to keep this sponge. I like the sponge. I might cut it in half so I can get like more use out of it. But I do like it. It's very, very nice. So this is the Dark Cocoa. And I'll have swatches on my site. The next one is... What is this? Natural beige. And this is really nice. More Caucasian shade. Gorgeous colors. Very well pigmented. Like Avon really did a good job at putting a lot more pigmentation into these foundations. This one is Soft Honey. And this is kind of light. More olive skin tone. So, of course, these were on sale, I think $5.99, something like that. But you can always catch them on sale. They'll be like two for $8.99 or something like that. And um, I think they were two for something. I'll check and I'll have the information down below. Now, this is the Ideal Shade Pressed Powder. These I'm not going to depot because I love how they just stack together. And you can just put all four of them in your kit. And this one is the light to medium. Comes with a little puff. Let me get rid of that puff. Yeah. This is the light to medium. Really well pigmented. Oh my gosh. I absolutely love all of, all of them. I didn't love them before. But Avon, you've made me a believer. Love you now. This one is the mocha this is the darkest really nice i like these because they don't come up chalky before avon's powders were so chalky and i just hated them i never used them this one is the which one are you? medium deep this is a nice one here And I'll have swatches on the website. And just to remind you guys, I already previously had the toffee. That's a nice color. This blends out so well that it works for a multitude of different skin tones. I love them. So that's that. See how well like all four of these stack? See how you can just put that like right into the side of your kit and have everything you need? Like bam. Bam. The cream the powder, however, look how bulky this is. <laughs> it takes up way too much space. So that's why they're going to be depotted and they're going to be put into this palette right here. Oh yeah, and this is the caramel. That's the one I already had. So, three more waiting to go in there. And then, while I was out, because for the umpteenth time, I was on a shoot. And I'm not going to say someone took it. But I lost my favorite 219 brush. 
So I had to replace it. You guys all know what this is. This is a fabulous brush. I went into MAC today and I replaced it. And then I also had to replace my MAC 239 brush. Now, I don't know what's going on because I'm going to show you one of my brushes that I have. Wait, where is that? This is my MAC 109 brush. Love it. I always, I went through and I painted the bottom of this so that nobody would take it so that I could always say, hey, that's my brush. Because even when I went on to shoots beforehand, girls would paint the bottom, but because we're girls, it would either be pink or it would be purple. It would be something. So I purposely chose this turquoise green so that it would be something different and I am still missing brushes. Moving on, yeah, I'm going to try something, even if I have to like zebra strike these bad boys up and down, I'm going to try something else because I am not purchasing these freaking brushes again. I'm not doing it. Alright, that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. There will be swatches and there will be uh, plenty of photos on my webpage tomorrow so check it out it's www.justbebeautiful.com and of course as always be beautiful everyone <laughs>